Welcome everyone. In today's video we will talk about 10 best places to live in Washington. The state was known as Columbia when it was an independent territory. The name was changed due to the necessity of distinguishing it from its neighbor, the District of Columbia. Washington is a wonderland with stunningly landscaped beauty and its unusual wildness. There are two active volcanoes in the state. Mount St. Helens, and Mount Rainier. It is home to more glaciers than the other bordering states, and has a classic Pacific Northwest terrain marked by the Cascades and a beautiful coastline. This state is the only one named after an actual U.S. president. As expected, the residents are among the highest earnings in the country, ranked 12th in the nation's per capita income. Washington is also one of seven states that don't have to pay the state's individual income tax. It also comes with an added benefit of significant savings on your energy costs, because the electricity rates are among the lowest in America. On the other hand, Washington's beauty and the perks of living here aren't at a price. It's a place you might want to move to if you're over your head, as the cost of living can be quite high with prices for housing. The top 10 places to live in Washington state are based on crime rate, school system, affordable housing, development, and prosperity. If you like our content, please do subscribe to our channel and hit the bell icon so you will be notified for our next videos. At number 10. Maple Valley. If outdoor activities are an important factor for you when deciding on a place to reside, Washington's Maple Valley will blow you out of the water. The state's terrain makes the part of it an outdoor sanctuary, but some areas such as Snoqualmie and Maple Valley take it a step beyond. Regarding education, the public schools located in Maple Valley are outstanding. This area is also appealing for those looking for affordable living in Washington. As homes can be purchased for an average of $700,000, and the average rent is $1,670, and a median household income of $114,000. There are many avenues to participate with the community, by joining the diverse organizations that support golfing, creative arts, and most importantly Lake Wilderness Park. At number 9. Snoqualmie. Snoqualmie is one of the towns within King County with a population of just under 12,000. The peaceful village, whose tranquility is interrupted by the sound of waterfalls, has seen significant growth throughout the years. Snoqualmie may be tiny, yet it boasts an award-winning school district. Growing as the population continues to be attracted by its beautiful surroundings. The median price for homes is $960,000 on average and residents earn one of the highest salaries within the state of Washington, which is $145,000 per household. The average rent for a two-bedroom home is $2,519. The small-scale community is ecologically conscious even though it is near industrial zones. A robust retail industry ensures that the shopping requirements of those with money are adequately met. At number 8. Richland. Certain areas of Washington can be pretty expensive, and finding places with low price homes and a low crime rate can be challenging. In terms of a good inexpensive alternative in Washington is concerned, we could not find a better option to win that prize than the oddly named Richland. The town is located within Benton County that is home to 52,300 residents. The average rent for an apartment is $1,165, with median home values of homes are $1.2 million. Golfing is a popular activity in the region, with four golf courses offering 63 holes. Like many areas of the Evergreen State, there are many parks in Richland. Every park activity can be found in Richland, including fishing for salmon, bird watching, water sports, biking and golfing. At number 7. Bainbridge Island. In Kitsap County, Bainbridge Island is the perfect example of Pacific Northwest scenery. The city of 23,500 inhabitants is the second most desirable location to live in the U.S. The remote suburb of Seattle remains true to its reputation, 
with its huge diversity and an active online business network. Bainbridge Island has the best public school education system. It also promises plenty of family-friendly outdoor activities, including hiking, fishing, little league baseball, and numerous other activities. Values of homes reflect the state's expensive cost of living, which is $800,000 on average, and some exceeding the $3 million thresholds. And the average rent for an apartment is $2,250. However, on the positive side, the residents can have a high standard of living. At number 6. Issaquah. It is an area of Seattle that is a favorite hiker's destination, due to its vast lakes and mountains. It only makes sense to call it the Trailhead City. It is the home of one of the biggest retailers in the U.S., Costco headquartered in the city. The median household income of families is $110,000. The city is growing, as evidenced by the number of apartment complexes popping up in the region. But the majority of properties are single-family homes, with a median home value of $1 million. And the average rent of $2,190 per month. Despite the growth, Issaquah is committed to becoming a hub for urban agriculture, by adding additional gardens and local foods. In terms of education, the town of 35,000 residents boasts some of the top schools in the country. At number 5. Pullman. The town situated in Whitman County on the southeast side of Washington, with 31,500 people. The thing that draws many residents to the scenic Pullman, is the low cost of living compared to the benefits it provides. Low crime rates, a wide variety of restaurants, entertainment options, shops, excellent education, and an abundance of outdoors activities. It is possible to rent a two-bedroom single-family residence at the cost of $710, which is below the national average. The value of a home in the region is affordable at $222,000. It is the home to Washington State University, where about 20,000 students are studying. In addition, the University of Idaho is only a few minutes away. If you're in search of an area that is reasonably priced, and has a college-like vibe with plenty of parks and natural spaces, Pullman is an excellent selection. At number 4. Kirkland. Another city located within King County near Lake Washington, a popular tourist attraction with several places. There are parks, beaches, outdoor activities, exclusive shops, bars and places to eat with live music. Kirkland is the 12th largest city by population, with 85,000 people. The residents have average household earnings of $117,000. The city is entirely bicycle and pedestrian friendly. It was the first city to implement alternative modes of transportation in its city plans and regulations. The median home value in Kirkland is $1 million, and the average rent for a one-bedroom is $2,280. The city has played the Little League Junior Softball World Series, in Everest Park for close to two decades now, dating back to 1999. At number 3. Bellevue. Bellevue is a French name that translates to beautiful view. It is located between two lakes, Lake Sammamish to the east and Lake Washington to the west. There is a trail known as the Lake Trail, which connects the two lakes, making it simple to visit both and enjoy the various things to do in both. The beauty of Bellevue is much more than Lake Deep. The town of 135,000 inhabitants is situated against the backdrop of the Olympic and Cascade Mountains. The natural beauty is something that many residents can enjoy, offering a variety of biking and hiking trails. But Bellevue is more than just natural beauty, and it is a bustling business community with a lengthy list of renowned companies located in the region. Redmond isn't too far away, so companies like Microsoft and Nintendo have a significant presence in the city. The median home value is $1.3 million, and the average rent for an apartment in Bellevue is $2,480. The median household income is $120,000. 
Combine this with A-plus rated schools, a variety of fairs and celebrations, such as Bellevue Strawberry Festival. A lively nightlife scene, and one of the most desirable areas to reside in Washington. At number 2. Redmond. Technology enthusiasts will be aware of Redmond as the home of Microsoft, which is also the largest employer in the city. The town of 58,000 residents is the top spot to live. It's located in an ideal location. Only 16 miles away from the state's capital cities. A house here will cost you $1 million on average, and rent for an apartment in Redmond is $2,325. The thousands of employees and the numerous tech companies that earn the average of $132,000 per family, Redmond is the location of the most well-known parks within King County. The Marymore Park which covers sprawling 640 acres are used as a place for picnics, events, festivals, concerts, bike trails and much more. This town has also got a an outstanding school system, that has been on the AP District Honor Roll several times. At number 1. Sammamish It's an urban area located in King County bordered by Lake Sammamish and 50,000 residents call it home. The town has developed from its rural origins and has grown into a thriving suburb with central access to Seattle. The Commons area guarantees acres of outdoor entertainment, including trails, wetlands, golf courses and events like Shakespeare in the Park. Like most suburbs of King County, the public schools are excellent, starting from the elementary level to high school. The cost of living in the area is higher than Redmond. And median house values of $1.4 million, with the average rent for an apartment is $2,365. The median household income is $175,000. In the end, there is no doubt that Sammamish is frequently ranked among the top areas to live in Washington. If you like our content, please do subscribe to our channel and hit the bell icon so you will be notified for our next videos. We will be back with another video. Until then, take care.